my name is Christy. For those of you that are new here, for those of you who are returning, welcome back. I am certainly glad that you decided to join me for another plan with me this week. Um, yeah, let's just kind of jump in, I guess. It's been a, been an interesting week. Um, yeah, there's just a lot going on. Um, there's just a lot going on. I'm just, you know, guys, I can't, I really thought this year was going to be good. <laughs> But it appears that it decided to not be, and I'm dealing with it slowly. So let's just leave that there because I don't want to get upset again. And it's just been a rough couple of days. Um, my manager at work, her mother passed away yesterday. I have um, an uncle who is actually in the hospital in Louisiana. Um, he was diagnosed well, he was put in the hospital, I guess Thursday had been a week ago. He was um, with double pneumonia and he was diagnosed with COVID and he was put into ICU on Monday morning and on the ventilator and it's just not going well. So I'm a little worried. Um, yeah, I've just got a lot on my mind, but I'm hoping that planning this week will kind of start to make things better. Um, this week is going to be kind of my transition week to more fall themed click kits. So, um, yeah, you'll first of all notice that I have pulled out some more fall apropos nails. Um, these are the Dashing Diva. It's this brand. Um, these are the gel strips. I like these but not as much as I like the, oh, excuse me, the Encoco or the um, Color Street because those are thinner and these are more of a gel and you can really see like at the tips of my nails where I haven't been able to get them like fully like adhered, but like the glitter in these gel kits cannot be beat. It's just so pretty, but um, let me show you guys all of the stuff that I've gotten actually as far as that goes. This is um, what happens when something that was meant to be a very small hobby becomes a little bit of an obsession. Uh, it started out really simply and I told myself I wasn't going to use these and yada yada yada. So the ones that I'm going to show you first are my Encoco ones, which these are the ones that you can get at, I mainly get mine at Walmart or Ulta. Um, I actually picked these up at Ulta yesterday and it's just a swirled marble. It is so pretty. It's got pinks and blues and purples. It's just, I don't know that you're really getting the colors well on camera because I'm not in natural light. Um, I picked these up today at Walmart. It's just a nice little floral, which I thought was really, really cute. Um, I got this one today at Walmart as well. And it's just a a nude tone but it does come with two um well with accent strips with it and the accent strips if I had to like compare it to something color street wise I would say that the color um the accent nails pretty much look like Tokyo lights almost dead on so if you've ever used um, um, color street and you like Tokyo lights find this at your Walmart these are like five bucks and it doesn't take me long to do them and when I'm done they're dry um I got this one at Walmart as well. This one looks a lot like, I mean, it's quite similar if I had to call it. Um, this one is called Song of the Sea, but it actually reminds me a lot, it's just a little bit different of the Color Street um, Long Time No See. So I have both of these. I don't know which one I'm gonna wear first. I may end up putting these to the side to use, but so you get to see one of the Color Streets there. And then I got this, um, in Coco today, just another floral because I kind of liked the floral print. The other ones that I've gotten from Color Street, um, I got is this one called Coral Bay. I love this one, like love, love, love. This one's gonna be one of my favorites probably for fall. If nothing else, I may save this for December. I don't know because I think that'd be a pretty Christmas nail. Now this next one I'm going to show you, I have two of, but that's because a really good friend of mine sent it to me because um, she knows my obsession with honeybees because of my stepmom. 
and this is um, called B BU. Yeah, this was one of the ones that they just released recently. Um, and one of my really good friends sent it to me after I had already ordered it myself from Color Street. So I'm super excited to use this. I'm probably going to use this one the week of, um, actually the week of the anniversary of my stepmother's um, passing because this year is 15 years. Then the last one that I have is this. And these are two, some of my favorites. This one is called Plaid About You. I think this is from actually the spring line, but to me it just screams fall. Um, I want to see if I can find a solid color and like a burgundy to wear with that just because I think it'd be really pretty. So yeah, um, I think I have a slight addiction here. So let's put those to the side. Um, the other thing that I'm going to show you before we get started, and you'll get to see one in a second. Um, I did get an order in this week from Heather Bico. Um, you'll see one of the um, dashboards in here. Um, this is another one I got. I liked the personalization and I love the Tiffany boxes. So I really thought this one was pretty. And then, I mean, I got this for work. Let's be real. I did get this vellum and I actually got a white glitter cardstock to put behind it when I put it in. I just think it's so pretty. And then I got this one because I love it so much. And then this one, which I just thought was really, really pretty. I haven't, I, you know, Mackenzie asked me the other day when I posted something about wanting to go get a bunch of stuff from Michael's, um, asking if I was going to do a planner setup. Eventually I would like to, but I'm going to show you guys why I'm not necessarily going to do that immediately. Like I was playing around this morning and I had to go out and buy a new paper cutter today because mine's trash. So I had this beautiful paper, right? This is the prettiest freaking glitter paper I've ever seen. You see it's hole punched twice. It's because I was trying to figure this out and I struggled through it and I screwed up this piece of paper. Mind you, they're only 59 cents, but I didn't feel like going back to Michael's. So, but this is like my favorite. So I have a whole bunch of glitter paper that I've gotten and yeah, so you're gonna kind of see my first shot at this and um, we're gonna keep figuring it out as I go, we guess. As we go I guess there we go um so this is the dash that is currently in here um you will notice that I guess I cut this too short that's why the glitter backing is there it's fine this was the freebie that came with my Heather B co order which I thought was really really cute um and I need to I want to kind of like I think I'm just gonna move this to here Like I'm trying to figure out how I want to, I have like, it's not even really a washi card, but I have uh, some washi that um, my friend Hannah, who is who I get my color streak from, she had sent me. So this is the dash that I have. Now this is the current, like just what I have in here. This is the other piece that I cut this morning. I feel like I did a much better job on it. It's still not perfect, but she's pretty. Um, I'm hoping that one day, eventually, my Aura Estelle order will get here. But I don't know if that's ever going to happen. So, this is where we've ended this week. Obviously, you guys know the way I've been planning lately. There's not anything to really write during the week, except for over here. I've been terrible about marking my hydrate, but that's partially because I've been terrible about drinking water. <laughs> she says she downed some more water. So, yeah. That's kind of where we have left this week. So now for what we're using next week. And I'm super excited about this. Um, you guys know that I am the hugest proponent of using one of Nikki's bundles during the month that it is for. So to keep that tradition, um, this week I am using the August bundle. You guys, I feel so strongly about my love for this kit. First of all, don't start with me. You guys know how I feel about foxes. And I also just felt like this was a great transition into fall because the colors aren't like super like orange and brown and all of that. It's such a like pastel fall that I really, really, really kind of loved it. And I love how these colors are coming off on camera. It's just my favorite. And this bottom washi, like, 
Yes, please. But now the one thing I will say is that much like, and this does come with the mini kit as well. So the subscription that I get comes with the, I get the large, which comes with the deluxe, the mini, which this has changed now to be the foil like version of a deluxe that she has now. So it comes with the deluxe, the mini. Um, I don't, there was that extra in there. Um, did she not? No, it's there. Okay. Anyway, and then obviously our foil stuff and our foil scripts. I can't remember if the scripts are going to be in there anymore or not. I, I would have to look at it. Honestly, I'm not sure. So, all that said, we're going to kind of jump into this this week because I need to plan a little bit. I may chat. I may not chat a whole lot. We'll see what happens. Um, in any case, I'm super excited too because what's the name of this company that I ordered? I did order um, some monthly kits for my Aura Estelle from Pretty Organized Plans. And you guys, these monthly kits are so freaking cute. And she dispatched that order really, really quickly. So I was like super thrilled. And she said that hers are sized for um, EC or Aura Estelle, I believe. So I like that you can choose your month and all of that. Um, let me see. Is this the, the one I got for? So which one's the one I got for October? I mean, September. Oh, I think I got this one. So this is the one I got for September. So it's just the... Um, it's just sunflowers, which I thought was really, really pretty. And then for October, I got the Boo Kit because I thought it was really, really cute. Um, yeah, it's just like you guys can see, it's more the Halloween colors. Um, and you can also choose skin tone options and all of that. And then for November, I did not go with a holiday theme. I went for a birthday theme. And you can choose your foil color on these two, which I really, really loved. So I think with my birthday one for November, I went with rose gold. For s September, I think I did gold. And then for our October, I want to say I did silver. I'm pretty sure that's what I did. But that should be coming. Matter of fact, if I do track package... Yeah, it's out for delivery right now with the Postal Service, which is pretty ironic considering that my Aura Estelle package has not been scanned since San Francisco. So, and then part of me is like, did it get caught in a fire? Because with the way my luck works, that sounds like something that would actually happen. Okay, so... Did I pull out the wrong sheet on this one? I think so. What the heck did I do? Hold on. No, I have two pieces of paper. I know I do. Okay. I was gonna say, there should be a monthly there. Okay. Because this one obviously would be the last week for August. And this will complete my first month planning. And I can't believe I've had this this long. Goodness. I love these glitter cardstocks. It's like my favorite thing in the world. And I'm aware, like I said, that this is not perfect right now. We will get there. And yes, I know. I am every basic planner girl who saw this in Andrea's video. Who I'm sure I don't even know whose video Andrea saw it in. But you know what? I like it and I think it's cute. So, fine. Whatever. You can pigeonhole me there. I don't care. <clears throat> I'm perfectly fine being pigeonholed. So, as we always do, I'm going to lay down the base of the spread and all of that, and then we are going to come back here to plan the week together. And I don't know why I had these date covers. I think I forgot that I had these. So, I am going to lay all of the base down, and then we will come back here to plan the week. So, I will be right back.
So I was going to finish laying down the headers, but I decided to just wait a second and I'd kind of talk through that. And I just, it's just what I felt like doing because I'm just in that kind of mood today. So we're going to talk through that. And the way I'm kind of doing this is I'm not necessarily color blocking this week. So whereas before, like I went with how the date headers would have been. Um, let me tighten you guys in a little bit. And by the way, if you see ugly bruising on my <laughs> That looks great, doesn't it? Yeah, my dog got me. Yep, my dog got me. Um, she had, was that Monday or Tuesday? My pup had a, a rough week again. Um, you remember I told you guys um, that on Friday she went flying down the stairs on her little belly luckily she is smart enough to know how to fall like I mean the dog is like like we talk about like destructive indestructible animals like Holly is that animal um, so that happened on Friday and we were doing pretty good all weekend and all of that and here's the problem so we've lived in this house for three years we have wood steps just how the house is built um, we've never had problems with her before on them so I never really thought about doing anything because Holly is very much a creature of habit and I don't like changing things on her so I had never thought about putting anything on the steps for basically that reason because my thought process was I don't want to change something and put her in misery because I've changed something without you know just out of the blue so we did okay so let's just start there so we don't change anything everything's fine so now she's started this whole like two times she goes flying down the stairs okay great we gotta fix it now so I ordered some of um, the little stair pads on Tuesday I think I think it was Tuesday when it happened I ordered them Tuesday night I knew they wouldn't be here till Wednesday. Is this up all the way? Yeah, it is. Um, is this up all the way? Yeah. I'm just trying to make sure my lights are good. Um, so I ordered that Tuesday night and I knew it wouldn't be here until like the next evening. So in the meantime, the thought process was let's just pick her up and carry her downstairs to go to the bathroom so she doesn't have to stress herself out. You know, we called ourselves doing the right thing. And, um, yeah, orange, blue, then pink. Okay. So we do all of that. And it didn't work. It worked, but it didn't work. Because she was a nervous wreck on Tuesday night before bed. She didn't want to go. She didn't want to do anything the way she was supposed to because she was a nervous freaking wreck because of us picking her up and carrying her. Or like um, Tuesday night, I had like just put her leash on her upstairs, thinking surely this will <laughs> surely this will be easier. I was wrong. She had come apart and almost choked herself going down the stairs because again. That's Holly. And, uh, so I get her downstairs that night and we go to the bathroom. We do all the things we need to do on Wednesday morning, knowing that this is the day that I will finally have her, um, step treads in. So I'm like, okay, I literally just have to get through today. I, when, as soon as she woke up that morning, I went into the bedroom and I was like, okay, I think part of the problem is she's obsessed with jumping out of the bed on her own. Maybe if I make it a little bit easier for her and I just pick her up and put her on the floor, it'll make it easier for her going down the stairs. 
So I walked in there and I picked her up and I, like you literally have to surprise Holly because she doesn't like to be held. Um, anybody that knows or has heard the story knows that she was, um, what we think anyway, was a victim of abuse at PetSmart. So she gets a little nervous and I put her on the floor and I did not move fast enough when I turned around and she nailed me twice. Now what I need you, <laughs> need you to remember about that is Holly has potentially at most four teeth. Yeah, four teeth, I think four. So uh, saying that she got me with four teeth is that should tell you everything you need to know about how determined my dog is. So that like swelled up immediately. I was like, oh, this is good. This is <laughs> exactly what I wanted. But anyway, so Wednesday night we put the treads on the stairs and she, at first I was like concerned because I was like, oh my gosh, how is she going to adjust to this? Is she just going to skid right down the stairs now? <laughs> because it's Holly and she will take the hardest way to do anything. Like that's, that's my dog. It just is. But no, she has been a little champ on the stairs now. So I feel thankful that, um, that we went ahead and did that. And my mom put the rest of the treads on her steps. Which makes me feel better as well because my mother needs to have some treads on her steps because she has actually fallen a couple of times as well. Everyone in this house has fallen down these stairs, um, the two sets of wood stairs we have at least once. Mine was the, the Christmas before, well the Christmas we moved in. My best friend was before that and I think mom's gone down hers like twice and I worry about her because she is in her 70s and hips, you know, I mean nobody wants a broken hip. Okay, so, I love this. These colors are so pretty. It's like if you took spring and fall and made them have a, ba have a baby. It's the best. Okay, let's see here. Oh, you know what? Let me pause. I gotta go grab something. Let me make sure this is even too. I mean, it's probably about as even as I'm gonna get this camera. Okay, so let's just kind of jump in. Um, let's see. I pulled out a whole bunch of extra stuff this time, including some fall stuff. I didn't know if I would need it or not, but I figured better safe than sorry. I pulled out Chris's sampler. His is a little dark for this, but I still liked it. Um, trying to see if there's anything. Why the heck did I print that out? Okay. Or did I pull that out? The first thing I want is one of my coffee Mondays because, uh-oh, and I don't know, let me see if I have one or not. That's the coffee I ripped. Actually, I think, actually, no, no. The first thing I'm going to do is I know Monday, Mon Monday, I know Monday, Wednesday, and Sunday are my IG posts. So let's get those in first. I feel like that's one of the things that I always, so let's just do, let's do the colors Monday, Wednesday. And Sunday so I do have two pink ones so let's do Monday Wednesday and Sunday because I'm gonna kind of color block some of this stuff but not really because we're gonna base it off of oops let me tighten you guys in a little bit now okay so this is always gonna go at the bottom for me just because it's like a thing that I need to remember but I don't necessarily want it like blocking out time on my day you know yeah. so So 
so thankful that the people across the street decided to choose this exact moment to mow their freaking yard. It's okay. I'm just glad that it's not storming anymore, even though it's kind of like low key happy about it because with everything going on right now, it just didn't bother me in the least bit to have a whole bunch of rain occurring. Okay, so we're gonna use that too in a second. But I need my little munchkins. Where's the stinking ones I'm looking for? That's the working ones. There they are. I'm going to have to order more of these because I really like them. Um, I think I'm going to use this. This and then this. I'm trying to pull everything all at once when I'm doing it just so that. So we're gonna have to build from the bottom up on these days, obviously. Because I'll already have one down. But that's okay. Super cute. Don't mind that it bumps down into the header a little bit. Okay, and this one. Yeah, it can bump down to the bottom washi. It'll be okay. I like that. Okay. So the first thing I'm going to put down at the top. I need something very slight. And I think what we're going to use to back this is probably just a little thing. Just because these are easier for me to back with. Mm. You know what? I'm going to have to build from the bottom up now. Okay. I just thought about that. So now that I've put something on that day. I'm literally gonna have to build from the bottom up. Okay, so the next thing that I know on Monday, I've got mail coming from Amazon. Actually, now let's use this. And this is going to be for all posting needs to be done. So let's see what I have. Actually, I think I'm going to go ahead and use this to... I just realized I have, it's like as I find things, I would rather just go ahead and lay them down. Like if it's something simple. Like on the sidebar this week, I'm not going to use the dinners. I'm going to use meals. It's very dainty. But sometimes I kind of appreciate the daintiness of that. Okay. Okay, so that's that. I'm going to leave these out in case I want them at any time, just so I have something to kind of divide. I'm going to need that. Okay, I know I have an Amazon one. Not pull that out. That's that one. 
Do I not have one of the Amazon ones out? I know I had one of the Amazon ones out. I had to have one of the Amazon ones out. Let me see if I've got one up here. Even if I don't, whatever. It doesn't matter. I'm going to use them all anyway. So let's put down... The little Amazon with, and I just saw, the, oh, it's on a sampler. It's this one right here because I like the size of it. So here we're going to put this. Just like that. So that's for, I have some Holly's um, dog treats coming. And then, I think the biggest things I need to worry about on Monday is probably, well, I'm going to do my focus office, and then I need to make sure that all posting is done. So, I think what we're going to do for that, actually is one giant box. No, maybe not. That flags. I love how it's like, I look at these kits so much, but I don't even know what I have. Um, hmm. Actually, I know what I'm going to do. Hold on. I just thought of something. I just saw my flat lays. I'm going to use one of these in a second. But these, this is what I was looking for. So I'm going to use this for my focus office. Maybe, potentially, if it'll lay down properly. There we go. And then the other thing is going to be that I need to get all posting done that day because I didn't do it yesterday before I left. Okay, let me move some stuff around here. Stuff that has been used that is foiled and not foiled. Okay. I need my scripts. Which are at the back of the list, of course. Gonna need that the next day, so let's just keep that out. There's that. There's that. Don't need this this week. Or do I need this? Trying to make sure that there's nothing else that I need, like, in the immediate. Oh, wait. That one has... No, whatever. I've started so many of these sheets at this point that, like, it's not even funny. Okay. So, I've got orange, blue. Where's a brown? Something brown. Doesn't really matter what. Maybe we'll just use some washi here. Okay, and then I think we'll use one of these little guys right here that all posting needs to be done, but I also need a focus off a sticker. Okay, so let's take the all posting done one and let's just kind of put, it's going to go there because that's where it started to go down. It's even enough. Hate it, but that's just what I got. I'll put the focus on this right there. Okay, so now the only thing, and it's going to be this way, which 
which is exactly why I waited so long. But now I've got the heavy base car competing with the neighbor's lawnmower. It's a quiet plane with me today in my neighborhood. <clears throat> I think we'll just use one of these cups. There we go with the coffee Monday. Okay, so Tuesday. Team meeting will be first. And an email meeting stickers. It is a all-team meeting this week. I actually know in advance. I'm super impressed that I actually know in advance. So let's just kind of go big thing here for the team meeting. Somewhere in here, there's going to be a BA meeting, but I don't know when or where or why or how. But there will be. That's even enough. Okay. So now let's find our little meeting things. Which I'm actually going to need fairly certain, like pretty soon. That's the problem. Like I have to go through these occasionally and I need to start ordering like four sheets when I order them, but like just don't have the wherewithal. I think we're actually gonna start this set from like this day from this side and then I need my team meeting script and now I put to the side and I don't know where I put it oh boy you guys there it is okay so the team meeting will now be done Okay, then biggest part of this day is probably going to be working on my focus office, but this morning here, I think what I'm going to do is do some more prep work, or maybe I'll do that in the afternoon. So let's just work on focus office here. Use this again because I kind of liked this combo and these are the um, work desk flat lays from uh, Nicole Alexia designs love them and I don't know if anybody else has birthdays this week that I need to mark down anyway I should probably look at that hole please So it doesn't look like there's any other birthdays aside from the one I knew I had to mark already. So that makes things easier. Oops. Slaying stickers again. Okay. So this time I think we're gonna do the focus office like here-ish. Oh, maybe I should tighten you guys in a little bit more. There we go. Okay. So now, Tuesday. What else is I going to mark? Oh, that's right. I wanted to do some more work. What can I mark that with? I know what I can mark that with. Where is my script sheet for... Planning. Well, I just had it a second ago. I thought I did. Okay. It's all going to be okay. It's probably right in front of my face. Okay, I think I'm going to use this.
And then I think the way we're about to layer this, and I don't know what other color do I want to use. Let's use a orange box, maybe. Let's just use a big orange box down here. It's probably the rest of my time. That looks pretty even. I mean, all things considered, I don't know if I'm going to get it any better. Okay, so let's take this now. So I'm going to use this very large planning right here. Probably about as even as I'm going to get it. Perfect. And now we're just going to kind of put this here. I think that looks kind of cute. I mean, it serves the purpose. Wednesday. Wednesday is another day now that we have to build from the bottom because of this little guy. So, Wednesday is probably going to be more focus office. So we're just going to put that here, I think. Actually, no. We're going to put focus office up here at the top. Somewhere. Right there. And then I think I'm going to put, so I just use orange. So let's go with blue next. And when my next order from Kinsey gets here, it's going to be a lot easier for me to mark stuff because I'll have more of the things that I also need, but I didn't order them until this last time because I, the way this has kind of been working for me as far as custom scripts is like, I have to think and it's like, until I start putting scripts down, I don't realize what other things I may need. And then the other thing that I want to mark here is I want to put in all posting done so I think we're going to do that in brown because I have that pink down at the bottom. So we're going to put this little guy here. He's straight enough. And then I'm going to put him over here for the posting. Um, That's not what I need. I need the focus office and all posting done. And the reason I have to get all the posting done on Wednesday is because it's going to go on Thursday as well because I am off on Friday. Who is she taking days off? Um, so, yeah, I actually am taking a day off. And here in a couple weeks, I'll be taking another. Actually, the next time I take it, it'll be three. You wouldn't think I'd need any time off after the hellaciousness that was. Actually, you know what? I don't know that I'm going to put anything here. I think I'm going to pull this up. Brazen move. I know. And I think I'm really just going to put one of these little squiggles here. Because I don't think I have anything else that needs to go right there. So, we are just going to pull a little squiggly in, just like this, because I think that looks really cute, and that's mainly what I'm going to be working on anyway. Okay, so that's the first half of the week sorted, so let's move on to Thursday. All right, Thursday, focus office all day. Where did I put the focus off of the last one? This top corner. So I'm going to go off to this side this time. If I can find the focus off the stickers. Oh boy, you guys. 
Wait, it's right there. I found it. <laughs> Got that down, and then the other thing at the top is going to be again the all posting done because that's going to be of utmost importance. And actually, I think I'm just going to use this pink one that I had laying over here earlier. I'm just going to pop this down right here. And then, and actually, I may come over to my sheet right here and I think there is yes but I think what I'm going to use is maybe this little computer and I think we're going to go to this side just like that um Hmm. I'm going to put this down. And then for the evening, we are going to Oh no, I don't want pink again. Mm. So when I put, personally, when I put trash down, for me, that means taking out the trash. Oh, that's what else I got to mark on Thursday. It's Dr. Stone's birthday. I'm pretty sure it was the 27th. Let's see what I've got here. Let's use, see if we can get that off of that sheet. So first I want to go ahead and at the bottom, I think I'm going to take this, I think it's the more peachy tone that would work better. Yes. Yes. She would probably be big mad about that because she's, yep, that's okay. And if it's not actually this day, I'm pretty sure it is though. I just really wish I could find out. Hold on a second. No, that there's got to be a way. You can't tell me that somewhere on the internet <laughs> doesn't exist my doctor's birthday. Why? It's that whole thing like where I'm like, maybe if I type in the month too. <laughs> the problem is it constantly autocorrects the way her first name is spelled because it's not spelled that way. Let's see. Let's see here. 
So Big Brother. I can already tell you I've watched spoilers. Well, I've seen, like, looked at Joker's updates and I'm probably not going to like it. Let's see. Um, I don't need detailed information. Goodness gracious. Um, let's see, I'm sh pretty sure this is the same exact thing I just did trying to find a birthday. Y'all, this is crazy. It should not be this hard to find. Let's see. I don't really care about social media. I'm just needing a date. <laughs> I'm fairly certain I'm right though. I wonder if I wonder if that's somebody else getting their trash. Okay, so here's the thing with Big Brother. So I don't understand what these people are doing because you probably should I don't know. I'm just really irritated because I feel like the like younger ones are like really effing themselves over. Because they're not getting what's really going on here. You know what? I'm just gonna. I'm I'm just I'm just going for it. I'm going for I, I, I'm just saying the 27th. I'm 97% sure that's what it is. That's what it's gonna be. And if it's not, I just won't open my planner at work. <laughs> okay, I have 4,000 pieces of paper. I need a, because I just can't be bothered to sit here and flip around in this any longer. I need this in a second. Didn't I pull all the little birthday guys? I know you guys saw me do it, and now I just don't know where I've put them. There they are. Never mind. Okay, we're gonna put this little guy here, maybe. Maybe we'll kind of situate him like off to the side and tilt it a little bit. Yeah, that's cute. I probably didn't need him there, but he's gonna be there. I'm sure you guys can hear my sweet, sweet little papa. So I've got, so let's do the brown one. And I'm using the smallest possible sticker to put this on. I don't know why. It's just what I'm doing. Um, and I believe Nikki said there would be new releases this day too. I'm thinking. Which... I'm pretty thrilled for. Don't know what she's been working on, but I'm pretty excited because we are going into the Planner Girl's favorite time of the year, which is these clear stick. You know, I can't today. I don't have the energy. Just give me the blue trash can. Okay, we're gonna take this and put it here because though it's not technically trash day we have to put it out this day so that's why we're putting that there okay friday yay we made it to friday okay we shall have a day off and do i have anything skinny enough to go up there what fit on the other side? I don't know, a piece of washi fit over there. I just think I might have given myself 
Oh no, that's right. I used a little thing. Maybe. We can use another one and just find something to put over it. Or do we maybe put the payday up here? Maybe that's what we'll do. We'll put this happy little guy right here. And then we'll find the payday script in this massive mound of stuff that I have here. I've really got to start sorting through these. That needs to come out. This stuff is all done. There's my payday. I'll need this in a minute with this and this. This is literally going to be in a minute. Okay, guys. All right, let's just focus on what we have here. I get like so focused on other things and then I forget what I was doing. Okay, let's just work through what we have. And then we can organize stuff later. Mark that payday down right there. Okay, then the next thing we're gonna mark with the orange. I said this is a day off. And we're at my little day off. And these are, once again, um, the Banana Doodles Goes Minimal Day Off stickers. Which I didn't really go through a whole lot of. And Till the COVID hit. Okay. Now, what day off really means is, hey, I'm about to do 150 things in rapid fire because, yeah. Okay, so let's start with, we'll make the list of places to go down here. But here, what I need to mark down is pay the mortgage. Is there a little house on the sheet? I hope there is. There is. Yay. Okay, so we're just going to put this down right here. And I'm going to take the little house. We're going to put it kind of tilted, I think. And now we're going to take the mortgage sticker. Just like that. Now, down here. This is about to be a lot. So I'm thinking that actually... What I might want to do, and I don't even know if I, I think I only have the laundry girl. Let's see though. Because I think that I do. All right, let me grab. Actually, this is about to reset itself, so give me just a second. Okay. So, I think what we're going to do down here is we're just going to put the girl with the grocery shopping cart. And I literally think she's just going to possibly go. Actually, I think I know what I want to do. Oh, I just used pink, though. I guess it's okay because... No, I know exactly how I'm going to do this. I think. Okay, we're going to use the big orange sticker. 
is this is going to be like my little day of errands basically. So I think I'm gonna put her right about here. Okay, then we're gonna do two more strips. We're gonna do a blue and a brown. This is probably gonna be extra AF, but you guys have been watching my channel, most of you, for a very long time, and you know that extra AF is me. So let's just all move past that. Okay, so what I'm gonna do with these, is I think, yep, I know exactly how I'm going to do it. We're going to do Trader Joe's over here. This is probably going to be way too much, and most people would probably say it is way too much. Why do some of these stickers just not come off the paper? I wish someone would explain to me what exactly I did to deserve this level of foolishness from sticker paper. There it goes. It's good to know that the sticker's not actually broken, it's just the paper was a hot mess. And then I'm gonna put Walmart right here. And then we're gonna take And this was a sampler from station stickers that I had from, I assume it was from, yeah, Ultimate Planner Sale. I really like this sampler. I really like the fonts here. So I may have to grab some of these at some point because I like them so much. Um, I feel like I wanna use something like on either side here, but I don't know what I would use. Maybe, ooh. Maybe we could use an orange heart and maybe a pink heart. And I think I'm going to put the pink with the brown because pink and brown is one of my favorite color combinations. If I can get the sticker off my finger. So we'll put this here just as a little gap filler basically. And also that leaves me with blue and orange and I'm a Gator fan so any shade of blue and orange will do. That's actually kind of cute. Okay, so now Saturday. Now that I've filled all of Sunday. Saturday morning is probably going to be a sleep in. But I believe how we're going to start this is. Um, and I probably, I'm going to mark filming on Friday, on Saturday, but I'm probably actually going to do it here. We'll see though. So let's just go ahead and start the day with that. And I think I'll take the pink that I was going to use at the bottom and put it right here. Okay, and then let's find our planning stuff. And I may actually do a flat lay this time. I'm gonna layer this, I think. Didn't I just have a planner one? Let's see. What do we have? I 
pulled out a whole bunch of stuff, but if I'm being honest with you, a lot of it I don't use like I should. Actually, I think we're just gonna use the foil from the kit because I know that the plan has to be in here somewhere, right here. Okay. So now down here at the bottom, I'm going to mark something else, but I think the other thing I might mark here is my, I wonder if I can fit my meal prep in there too. We're certainly going to give it a shot. I literally threw there. Okay. And I'm having to change up my lunches again, you guys, because I had switched to a version of tuna salad that was okay for my liver. And I learned very quickly that tuna is one of those meals that <clears throat> you really can only eat so many times before your body just goes, no. So that's where we were at. My body said no. And when my body said no, it said it would have vengeance because I made enough for the whole week, but uh, I didn't take it yesterday because I was like, I literally cannot choke down one more day of this. Um, down here now, I think what we're going to do is more about to layer some stickers. Just need to figure out what I want to layer. I think we're gonna kind of do something funky where I maybe like lay this here and maybe we'll do a brown no there's a whole lot let's throw some pink in this area and I think we're gonna kind of drop this down a little bit like that Where's my little book? And there was probably, no, that's my coffee stickers. And I need, do I need? I should be, there it is. I get to say something I never thought I'd say again. Well, at least not for a while. I get a version of a concert this day because Liam Payne is doing a live show via Veeps. So we will take it. Okay, it's Sunday. Okay, let's start organizing a little bit because this is going to start getting messy if I don't. And it's already getting messy. And I know that you guys, I'm sorry that you can just see my arm. I know you guys don't know this about me, but that drives me batty. Okay, this needs to stay out. This can go away. This can go away. And I'm trying to decide, do I want to use maybe this? This can go away. Potentially, oh, this is all stuff that can go away. This might need to stay out. I am the worst. For leaving a whole bunch of stuff out. Okay. I don't even know. Oh, well, the first thing that we need to mark, well, see, what did I tell you guys? Wasn't I just looking for that? Okay, so we need these two. This one can go back here. This can go back here. Really, I don't think we're marking a whole lot on Sunday. But what I do think we're going to do is... Do I have any more big pieces of washing? Maybe in the... Yes. I think we'll use a blue. We're going to put this right here. And 
I think we're going to take, do you want the girl with the clothesline? Yeah, maybe. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. I can't believe I managed to do that without ripping something off. Okay. I think we're just going to kind of center her right here. Okay. And then we're going to take the laundry scripts. Put it like up here, just like that. That's cute. Okay, now the only two things I think I'm gonna mark on Sunday, I'm just all over the place today, guys, and I'm sorry. It's just, there's a lot going on and I'm just a hot mess. So let me go ahead and kind of organize myself. Um. Where's my YouTube emoji that I just had right here? There's the upload. So let's take this little guy, put him there. I'm trying to be better about making sure that things go back where they're supposed to. If I have a bad habit of not doing that. Okay, let's put this all here. Okay, I need a strip of, actually, nope, I don't. Let's just use this up at the, actually, let's, I can probably fit two things aside from this. So I'm gonna put the little upload sticker on this side, dropped down like that. And it seems kind of redundant, but I'm still going to put the upload on it. Okay. Then the other two things that I'm going to put down. Uh, let's do a pink and a brown. But let's do the brown first. And then the pink. Just like that. Okay. So the two things I'm about to mark. I want to make sure that I take some time to sit my rear end down and relax. I don't know what that's going to look like. Actually, I'm going to use this little me, I mean this little unplug one. And this is super crooked and I don't know if I'm gonna get it off of here. That looks better, I think. Okay. And then the last thing is I would like, um, let's say, is there, take this little guy with the coffee and you will start seeing obviously more of my little fall emojis starting to make their appearances so for the coffee let's just put that there I think I can fit this just like that. Okay, and then that is going to be for me time. I also think I'm about to snatch this little Hello Weekend sticker. Put it at the top. Here-ish. Um, okay, so the other thing was the me time, me time, me time. Which, oh, I literally just looked at it again. 
Guys, I promise I'm not going crazy. There it is, up at the top. Okay. I'm gonna tell you guys, I did a pretty good number on this kit this week. I mean, I'm having to pull pieces of it from here, there, and everywhere, but I did a decent job on it. Okay, this goes here, 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 here. here. All right, so well, let's take a look at the zoomed out. trying to slide all my stacks of stickers back. There we go. Oh guys, this is so pretty. So I don't have a whole lot of writing to do this week. Um, but actually I can do that while I'm just talking to you guys because that way we can just close out the video right here. So let me just get my pen, which I am using the Sharpie um, S-Gel. And this is the 1.0, so it's the bold tip. I prefer bold pens. It's just a personal preference. Um, so let's go ahead and write hydrate. And then I've got to figure out what my meals are going to be for the week. I guess it would help if I tighten you guys back in for this, huh? My handwriting is atrocious. It's fine. Okay. Is it called the LP Show Act 2? Yes. The LP show act two. So let's see if we can write this well. Okay, so I think that is going to be it. Let's wipe our back out. All right, that is perfect. All right, guys, so this is where we are going to leave it this week. Um, like I said, I think Nikki was saying before that she will be having new releases this week. I can't remember for sure, but if she does, as always, her shop will be linked down below. Make sure you take a look. Um, I know that she has been powering through a whole lot of releases god love her i don't know how she does it i really really don't especially with you know the postal service and everything in the state that it's in right now like i said i am still waiting on things that <laughs> uh, my aura style package literally entered the country like um the 11th was scanned in san francisco on the 11th A little switch of plans here so we had to change to the phone because well the uh the camera died so 
um, yeah, my Aura Estelle package has been in, it was in San Francisco on the 11th. I don't know where it is now. Um, hmm. Don't know how long it'll take to get here either. So anyway, um, that is going to be it for this week. I hope that you guys have enjoyed watching. I hope you're all staying safe and um, taking care of yourselves and washing your hands and wearing your masks and doing all the things that we should be doing. Um, leave a comment down below how ready for fall you are because I am super ready. And yeah, um, I'll also leave a link below to uh, Nikki's subscription. Just keep it bookmarked. Subscriptions um, usually open, I believe, on like the 4th or 5th. I'm not sure, but I'll try to put the information down below as well. Um, subscribe because you guys, this is the kind of kit that you get and these are absolutely amazing. Um, you saw like how much I did and I still have all of this left. So yeah, subscribe to Nikki's, uh, you know, the, the subscription kits are actually amazing. So yeah, that is it. I, um, hope you guys have had a great week. I hope you have a great upcoming week. And, um, if you're a praying or a good vibe person, please send some to my, um, my uncle, because he certainly could use them. He's, uh, he's in quite a battle right now. So yeah, that is it for this week. Um, take care of you guys and I will see you next week in my next plan with me. Bye guys. Bye.